It was a beautiful day on the UConn campus and stores, but tonight the focus is inside Gamble Pavilion, where the eighth-ranked UConn Huskies women's basketball team takes on their conference rival, the DePaul Blue Demons, in what is a rematch of a very physical contest played just two weeks ago in Chicago. Pretty bad, yeah. Very competitive. Dorky Yuha, San Anis tomorrow to tip it off. UConn wins the tip, but it's 1-2 to Paul. Kiara Collier has the perch. The grad student from Southfield, Michigan, will get called for that foul for DePaul. Here's Mule driving, and it goes. <laughs> the Edwards. Now Juhas, defended by Morrow, drives. Gets through the... Morrow out on Edwards, the pass in to Juhas, and a nice bucket for Edwards, no. Fought on the rebound, and the Huskies run. She'll stop, and drain it. DePaul just one of five from the floor so far in the game. UConn in a zone defense again. Kristen Williams with the steal on the cross-court pass. Oh, from way outside, this time Fudd gets the rebound for UConn. Really good hustle by DePaul. Leah Edwards working inside against Rogers. Got it. Juhas trying to get position inside on Rogers. They missed her. There's Kristen Williams. Nice pass from Leah Edwards. Leah Edwards showing some great passing skill. Tie ball game. Westbrook flips inside to Edwards. That pass almost a little too lazy. Kick to her on the outside. She'll drive. Good position there between Kristen Williams and Aliyah Edwards. That was good help by Edwards. Smart play. Mule sets the feet, lets it fly for three. Oh, and that's an indicator the officials are looking for for contact. Williams behind the Edwards screen. No, Edwards left early. But she's got the ball now underneath and gets it up and in. What a great move from Aliyah Edwards. Oh. That's the three fly. No, right in the hands of Mule under the glass. Flips it to Edwards and puts it up and in with the left hand. Mule calling out the play. There's Juhas back into the game. Inside to a cutting Westbrook. And Issa Morrow starts this second quarter on the bench. The freshman sensation. Juhas rolls, puts it on the floor. We'll get the bucket and the foul. Good recognition. I like that back cut by Juhas. It was a really good pass from Westbrook. Love the emotion, the energy. That the yeah, you don't often Huskies see it with too. these guys. Yeah. So Dorka Juhas. To Paul's defense, making them pay and cutting back door. Edwards has it knocked away by Held, recovers and puts it in. Edwards got away shuffling the feet too. Huskies number one bench coach and cheerleader, Paige <laughs> Beckers. <laughs> Pass thrown right to Kristen Williams. Here's Fudd on the run. Yeah, that's a rare turnover there by Lexi Hill. A little cut off there by Kendall Holmes. Williams kicks. Juhas for three. Yes. Mule defended by Morrow. Floats it over to Westbrook. Who drives and gets it. Here in the first half. Held kicks to Church. Too strong. Kristen Williams ahead to Westbrook. Five turnovers, no points in that time for DePaul. Mule to Yuha. Yuha's 4-3. Yes! Second made three for the grand transfer, Dorka Yuha's. But 2 of 8, 0 for 4 from 3 tonight. But remember, she got a lot of her points against DePaul in the second half in that game at Chicago. There's Mule. Yes! Williams drives. Got cut off, turns around. And it goes. Bud tries to work off the Edwards screen. Now Juhas, top of the key, into Edwards. Up and in with the left hand. In the three fouls, she's also playing with. Ball on the floor. Morrow led with the arm. No call. Lee Edwards that, sets sprawling. Yeah, that easily could have been an offensive foul. The no-look pass from Mule to Juhas for the bucket. And quickly giving it up before she got called for a walk. Juhas driving hard and in. Fudd from long range tonight. Edwards knocks the ball away. Morrow hits the floor. She got away with a foul, too. Definitely. And Edwards to the other end. Puts the bucket up and 
draws the foul. Williams takes it all the way to the rim. Stops a UConn 7-0 run and a 2 minute 12 second scoring drop for DePaul. Kristen Williams again, that for three. UConn's done a nice job with that full court pressure and what a pass and what a bucket. Williams cut off by Held but spins inside with the right hand. What a finish. Seated to her left on the bench is Diva Kelger, who also hasn't played in a while, who's kind of like their sixth man. And a good one. Look at the pass and the putback. At 10. Williams gets the screen from Edwards. The right hand, backhand flip off the boards. Another good read by Williams. And Westbrook steals the inbound pass, and it goes. Collier but kept after it and knocked the ball away and out of bounds. Edwards will steal the inbound pass. Westbrook to Williams, and the unselfish pass and bucket. Mule driving in and gets away from Held in the bucket. Who goes to the bench after her best game of the season. Westbrook drives and scores. A clock at five. Looking for a screen, not going to get it. Gabriel's trying to post up. So the turnaround, no, yes. UConn's got to be really happy with the effort they put forth. Collectively, they played some outstanding basketball without some of their key players. And now 1,044 games without back-to-back -back losses. The streak continues for Gino Auriemma and this UConn squad.